Welcome to Nibbling with the Neighbors! Okay everybody, welcome to another episode of Nibbling with the Neighbors. Today we're going to do some chicken pot stickers and some beer brats. And I'm going to start with the pot stickers. Uh, we do it a little different than the instructions, so we start with a little bit of oil. I got a 10 inch pan that this is, tells you for a 10 inch pan you're going to put one tablespoon of olive oil in the bottom. So I'm just going to use my uh, one of the pot stickers to push all the olive oil around and then we just set up the pot stickers okay so I got in as many as I can that'll fit in here somebody's hair I'm sure it's one of the cats <laughs> and so and then I just put two two thirds cup of water it might be different depending on the size of the pan that you're using then when it starts boiling I'll cover it for eight minutes and after eight minutes that's when I change things up a little that's when he changes it up a little mm-hmm okay okay so now it's boiling so we want to just turn it down to medium and cover it I am going to let it boil off for about eight minutes. So here's the only thing I actually do different. I take the teriyaki sauce and instead of using it for dipping, I just pour it all over. soaks in and cooks in and I will let that reduce and simmer until it's sticky. So what you cooking? Good I, looking? I am cooking beer brats. Okay, I'll tell you what kind of beer they use. Do they smell like beer? Yeah, they smell like brats. So this is the second part of what my dinner today And that's pretty simple. We're just going to uh, char some flesh until it's not pink anymore. We're done. Okay. These brats are done. Sufficiently charred. And you didn't set them on fire. I set nothing on fire. I don't know what you're talking about. This time, they look yummy. They smell yummy. Okay, so the brats are cooked, and I am going to make myself a sandwich. I bought uh, some freshly baked rolls, so I'm going to do that. Uh, Val cannot have bread, so I'm just going to throw a couple of brats on a plate. And give those to her. Can I have a knife and a fork and a little no. little thingy to go underneath it too? No. Gosh. Boy. You just want, want, want. Yeah. Okay. And I'm going to put some uh, mustard with horseradish on mine. Because that sounds yummy. Whew. And that's it. All right. Let's do the taste test. Chicken pot sticker. Sticking to the pot. Sticking to my ribs. 
And let me know if it tastes like beer since it's supposed to be a beer brat. <laughs> Doesn't smell like beer. <laughs> John's tasted like beer. Did he soak them in beer? I should have soaked them in beer. Mm. Maybe a little. It's okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Did you get any of the brats or just bread? <laughs> little hot? Yep. <laughs> Pretty tasty though. That's good. Okay everybody, so that wraps up another episode of Nibbling with the Neighbors and we have an announcement. With me leaving to go back to North Carolina to be with my family, I am not going to be here to film any Nibbling with the Neighbors for an unknown amount of time. So we are asking once again for you guys to send us your cooking videos as special guests on Nibbling with the Neighbors. So if you have a cooking video you would like to submit, please send that to the neighbors KVM at Yahoo.com. See y'all later.